Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to Drama Queen. In today's video, we are going to be touching on a subject that is pretty serious. That's why I put a trigger warning at the start of this video, just because some viewers may feel triggered by what we talk about today and I just want to let people know, you know, if you struggle with that, please just know that we are going to be speaking about that in today's video. I don't want to catch anyone off guard with what we're going to be talking about. So with that said and out of the way, let's get to a DM that I was sent this morning along with literally hundreds of other DMs over merchandise. Hi Caitlin, very big fan of your channel since you speak on hard topics and start conversations which can be uncomfortable for you to start. I respect you so much for that. Thank you for acknowledging that. Uh, I really appreciate and respect you for noticing that. I want to bring something to your attention as soon as you can read this message. A body positive promoter and somebody who promotes eating with her ED audience etc has done some pretty disgusting merchandise. At least that's how I see it. I'll send you photos after I send this message but it, but it says did you eat today which can be triggering for some people and can be super uncomfortable to see on somebody who may be struggling with eating disorders. They call it eating disorders for a reason and this merch ain't it and we need somebody to speak on this ASAP because her intentions may be good but it's still not right. So here are the pictures of the merch made by Sienna May. She is somebody who promotes body positivity heavily on her platform and that's something that I have noticed and I really like because I think you know no matter who you are, what you look like, what shape, size you are, you know it doesn't matter because as long as you love you that's all that really matters. So with this merchandise it says did you eat today and people say you know that is her slogan kind of thing that's what she says but you have a lot of people who are not taking too kindly to this merchandise because it could be super super triggering to somebody who does struggle with an ED who you know if it was that easy to eat people would eat and there would not be such thing as an eating disorder and I think that it is very very important to encourage people People to eat and to feel okay about eating but it's another thing to wear it as an aesthetic. I am not going to wear my anxiety or my depression as an aesthetic that's just you know you have an illness and you're not going to be wearing it. It may be different for some people but I'm just speaking on my own personal opinions and feelings and that's just how I feel. I'm not going to wear a shirt that says did your depression let you smile today and I'm not going to wear a shirt that says Says, did your anxiety let you be okay today? Like it's just some really out of taste merchandise and I understand where the anger and the troubles come from people who see this merch. Sienna I think has had really really good intentions with her merchandise and what she's trying to do and the message that she's trying to put out there because yes it is so important to give your body love and to fuel your body and just just to eat in general, I do think that is important. Putting it on merchandise as an aesthetic to wear around, I don't think is okay. That's why I'm gonna say right now, I see both sides of the table. People are upset because this isn't something to be glorified. It is something that is so hard to go through. It's hard to watch people that you love go through something as horrible as struggling to eat and struggling to overcome body image issues, it's so fucking hard to watch. And especially when you don't know how to help them, that's what makes it worse. So that is why people are upset over just, you know, a sentence saying, did you eat today? It can come across to some people like, it's just saying, did you eat today? But some other people, it can come across a different way. The saying could be open for interpretation, but since she, that's what she encourages people to do. She encourages people who are struggling to eat to eat. Putting other people's trauma and putting their struggles onto a t-shirt or a hoodie is just very distasteful. And I hope that she sees how it can be distasteful and I hope she sees how like, you know, her fans are reacting to this and other people outside of her fan base 
Now, here's what Sienna had to say on, on her merchandise Instagram. The did you eat today question is not meant to make fun or glorify EDs, be harmful or ironic in any way. This question is hoping to encourage, check in with people if they actually ate. This question is about expressing compassion and care for those who are seriously struggling. Not liking this design, which is okay, is different than misinterpreting the meaning behind it, which we are hoping to clarify now. We create created this design with love and positivity in hopes of uplifting others and asking hard questions. We stand behind the true intentions of this 100% Sienna. So again, like I completely understand where Sienna is coming from. It is so hard to spread awareness about these types of things because people say all different types of things. And yeah, I mean, this is a situation where it's just so hard what to say is right and what to say is wrong because I get trying to bring awareness to something and I get where people are coming from with not wanting to wear their trauma on a shirt because I mean I certainly would not do that and I wouldn't even sell a shirt to people that is about that it's just so many other ways to bring awareness to this and I'm I think that's pretty much what I'm trying to get at so with that being said everybody please let me know what you think about in the comment section below I would love to hear both sides of the spectrum as I do with every video we do here on drama queen it is so important to get both sides of the situations opinions together because it's a very important conversation that we must have even if it is uncomfortable even if it is hard so with that being said everybody I'll see you guys in my next video please stay safe and take care of yourselves